Hey, what's up, family? Senior Cigar here. You are wherever you are, hopefully practicing social distancing, staying safe, staying hydrated, all of that. Uh, it is Friday. It is the day after. Hopefully you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Uh, you were able to spend it with family and friends, and you ate till you, you couldn't eat no more. And now, back to the real world. To many of you, you going back to work immediately. Some people have a day off because some companies, they give you Thursday and Friday off. You all know with me, I'm going to work. Made a little pit stop before I got to work, though. I'm at Davidoff of Geneva in Brooklyn. And uh, before I go any further, brothers and sisters of Leaf, if you hear music in the background, I'm not playing the music. I have nothing to do with the music. I'm not responsible for the music. I do not own the rights to the music. The music is being provided by the establishment. Once again, I do not own the rights. I'm not playing the music. I have nothing to do with the music. The music is being provided by the establishment. All right. So the weekend is finally here. And uh, here's hoping that you have a great time this weekend. And as always, I'm begging you, please be safe. I want to be able to talk to you next week. So how was your Thanksgiving? Hopefully it was a very good day. And now, Christmas season is upon us. Christmas is around the corner. The new year is around the corner. It's amazing how fast 2022 went this year. I mean, unbelievable. The time just flew by. But now, here we go. And speaking of here we go, all right, family, let's do this. Shout out to the medical professionals, first responders, EMS workers, police and fire, postal workers, MTA workers, delivery people, truck drivers going across the country, the mom and pop shop owners, the bodega shop owners, the laundromat owners, anybody who has been considered or deemed essential personnel. Thank you for what you've been doing during the pandemic. Thank you for taking chances with your own health and safety, for the health and safety of all of us in this city, in this state, in and around this country. What you have been doing, it is so greatly appreciated. Saying thank you is not enough, but we do start out by saying thank you for everything you have been doing during the pandemic. And of course, family, I got to remind you, please check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. So please do what you can to reach out to them any way you can. Whether it's through a phone call, a text message, social media, video chat, Zoom, house party, Google Duo, FaceTime, Skype. And remind the people within your circle of friends to do that very same thing. Get in touch with their elders and their family and friends who live alone. No one needs to be alone at this particular time in our lives. Absolutely no one. So please, take the time, make the time, do what you can to reach out to them. Find out how they're doing. See if they need anything. See if there's anything you can do for them. If this is someone you profess to love, then this should not be a problem. All right, fam? It is all about support. And while we are talking about support, please don't forget all those fine ladies and gentlemen who own those great cigar shops and lounges. All those fine people that own the mom and pop shops, the, the great small businesses out there, they need our support now more than ever as well. Whether it's a shop where you can come and make your purchase, grab and go, or maybe it's a cigar lounge, kind of like Davidoff, with comfortable seating, where you can come in, make that purchase, sit back, relax, find a spot to plop, sit back, relax, light up, put some smoke in the air, like so. Maybe pair that fine tobacco product with your drink of choice. And oh, by the way, today, La Gloria Cubana, Serie R Esteli Maduro, number 64. Classy glass, classy place, San Pellegrino, blood orange, sparkling water. All right. 
Uh, maybe even uh, start up a conversation with another brother and sister relief. But none of that can be done unless you, yes, you, make the effort to go to that mom and pop shop. So, this is what we're doing. You're going to break open the piggy bank, fellas. You're going to open up that wallet, blow the dust out, pull out some dollar, dollar bills, y'all. Then you're going to make your way to that mom and pop shop. However you can get there. You're driving. Maybe you're going to jump on the bus or the subway. Maybe you're going to take that Uber or Lyft. Maybe you're going to get on a bicycle or a moped or a pogo stick or a skateboard or roller skates I said roller skates and make your way down to that mom and pop shop and when you get there you're going to walk right in take a look around make your selections proudly step up to that cash register and make it rain baby make it rain Spend a few dollars to keep their cash register ringing and their door open because it is all about support. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. Hashtag support black business. Hashtag support Latino business. Hashtag support Asian business. Hashtag support small business. Now, family. What's the plan for tonight? You still a little, are you still a little worn out from yesterday with all that eating and hanging out? And, or maybe, you know, hey, maybe you're going to hang out again tonight. Maybe you've got a plan for a nice romantic dinner with your significant other. Or maybe you decided you're going to meet up with some friends, hang out at a bar. Maybe you decided you want to go to that cigar lounge and meet up with some brothers and sisters who leave and put some smoke in the air like so. Yep. Or maybe you got to see a movie or a Broadway show or a concert or a comedy show. Or maybe you decided you got your courage up and you want to <clears throat> go sing some karaoke. Whatever you have planned for tonight or any night moving forward, please make sure that a part of that plan is staying safe. Stay safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. Coronavirus is no joke, family. We have lost so many lives. We have lost too many lives, and we don't want to lose any more. So please, I'm begging you. When you go out, have a plan, and make sure a part of that plan is staying safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. And part of staying healthy, family, is staying hydrated. When you go out, make sure you got that bottle of water or that lemonade or that iced tea or whatever you need to stay refreshed and hydrated. I'm telling you, take it from Senor Cigar. You will not regret that piece of advice and you will thank me later. So once again, please, don't forget, have a plan. To stay safe so you can stay healthy so you can stay alive all right fam i'm gonna wrap this up so i can continue to enjoy my fine tobacco product this little gloria cubana siri r Estelle maduro number 64 get my smoke on before it's time for me to go to work press those buttons ride those levels and do what i do so please family don't forget Check in on the elders and family. Your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that together we will get through this. And yes, we will get through this. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. And whenever you go out, whether it's tonight, tomorrow night, anytime this weekend, any night moving forward, if you're going out, have a plan and make sure that part of that plan is staying safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. That is it. That is all I got. 
I am that man sitting a cigar, enjoying my fine tobacco product, popping my collar because I can. And as always, I want to wish you long ashes. And better days. Y'all know. Love you like a fat kid loves cake, and I hope to talk to you again real soon. But in the meantime, holla if you hear me. Yeah, bye, bye. Thirty.